You know, guys, for most of us here, most of these people out here at the festival tonight, Kansas City barbecue just go together. But a lot of Chiefs players out here for the first time tonight didn't know what they were in store for. Arrowhead Stadium, known for Chiefs football and Kansas City barbecue. If you think about it, where we're standing right now, there is on, on any game day, there's tons and tons and tons of barbecue being cooked right here by some great local chefs. So we brought some of the best local chefs and chefs from all over the country here. Chiefs first round pick George Karloftis knew the football part, but growing up in Greece had no idea KC was known for barbecue until today. I mean, that's one of the first things that was mentioned because everyone knows like I'm, I'm big into to food and grilling and meat and all that kind of stuff. So it was like, you know, this is like the barbecue season. Really? Joined by fellow top picks cornerback Trent McDuffie and wide receiver Sky Moore, coach Andy Reid and owner Clark Hunt introduced the players to what very well could become their new menu. I mean, it's such an honor to you know, feed you know, a legend like Andy Reid and then the up and comers that you know, hopefully will make a big name for themselves here in Kansas City. Soon after, thousands of others enjoying barbecue from a dozen pitmasters from around the nation. They say chili and barbecue are the only things that originate in America. And so we've got pitmasters from all over the country that are here sharing what they do from their part of, of America. The event is free throughout the weekend. There are demonstrations. And now if you want grind specific and you want heavy grind, well, we could do that. You know? Music and entertainment, even a rib eating contest. The Chiefs rookies will be busy at minicamp. Barbecue is off the chain. I mean, but maybe don't count Karloftis out as a surprise entry. This, this is my type of place for sure. It was me meant to be. Well, it's certainly meant to be. Now this event runs from 11 to 8 tomorrow, then 1030 to 5 on Mother's Day when they're going to have, catch this, a brisket and gravy brunch for all of them out there. And unlike what you're probably used to coming out at Arrowhead, both entry here and parking are both free, John and Christelle.